Welcome back to EA Sports continuing coverage of the American Hockey League. I'm James Cebulski. Always a good night of action on the ice here. Both teams seem ready, and they are about to drop the puck on this opening faceoff. The Bears get off to a good start as they win the opening faceoff. to play the puck. Shepard's been consistent all season long. I mean, his team's in the winning column. His save percentage is up, and he's a real reason why they have a chance in every game. Quick feed to Prisky. Oh, what a great save by Harrison. Moves it to Marodi. Along the wing, up the neutral zone. Oh, and a poor rattling hit right there. Uh, certainly was lined up perfectly body on distributed right in there. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Moves it quickly over to Beccioni. Solid hit on the play and that knocks the puck off his stick. Yeah, the officials didn't like that. The arms are in the air. And there's the whistle stopping the play. The Phantoms are getting penalized for slashing. frozen up. Wilman's gliding in for the face-off as this penalty kill will continue. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. Play rolls on. Quick pass to LaPierre. The Phantoms gain possession of the defensive zone. Puck dumped in. Hershey's got a hold of it against the wall. Slick feed. The Bears play the puck from the back of the net. Here's a short pass to Huntington. The Bears look around near the point. Hershey's got the puck against the boards. Quick feed to LaPierre. The Bears looking against the half wall. Into the corner now. Picked up by Gartner. Picked up along the wall by Beccioni. And he goes off a stick. Trying to get it out of the zone here. And they get it out. The Bears gain control of the puck against the wall. Rose swooping in on the attack. Rose is almost ready to get back on the ice. Oh, the play! That's a true competitor's save just when you think that he's completely out of it, James. He comes across with a desperation save to keep his team alive. Moves it to Marodi. Takes it into the slot. Oh, what a chance to open things up, but he misses. A huge opportunity to get the first score of the game. You can see the frustration as he looks up at the roof. The one-time blast denies him on the one-timer. Oh, what reaction. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. We're still scoreless. The Phantoms come up with the defensive zone draw. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Grabs it in his own end. In all alone, on the breakaway! Big time save! Oh my goodness! Well, throw technique out the window. This time it's all about the competitive will to get to that puck. The Bears play it along the blue line. And that's broken up. Knocks the puck down with a stick. The Phantom slide it through center. Takes the puck at the point. Spectacular save on the play. That opportunity's rejected. And that's intercepted by Zamula. 
Right up Main Street and on the attack. Shot to the Isom. Shepard's made a great quality shot look easy. I mean, he is so efficient. He's dialed in, he tracks, and he makes the save. Here's the shot. And he takes that one with the clock. Just here in the late stages of this frame, we've still got zeros on the board. Offense is on face off, and he wins the draw. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Here's a blast! He scores! The captain leading by example! Well, this is just a perfectly placed slap shot, James, and he's done all the time in the world to walk into it. Load and explode, and he beats the goaltender six side. in the books, second period just around the corner. A chance for both teams to refuel. They are back on the ice, and period number two is about set to go. The second stanza is underway as the puck is dropped. Let's go. Well, Cheryl, he's on the board for the season. Oh, that's going to feel good because he has had a drought, has me, James. So he's got the monkey off of his back, but he'll want to pace that with another one shortly to feel real good. Well, he certainly looks frustrated after letting that goal in, James. It's almost like a fielder in baseball. If you touch it, you should be able to stop it. And then he gets a big chunk of that one. Unfortunately, it goes in the netting. The Phantoms have evened things up here in period number two. We got ourselves a new game. Yeah, you love these games that go back and forth. And they've worked hard to get to this point. And now they got the equalizer. Giddy up. Moves it quickly over to Heinen. Rebound control is critical in the game of hockey. Putting it to the corner, and now the offensive player has to pound the puck. Snidely's six snaps, and he's off to the bench to get a new one. Gets back into the play quickly. Shot and he scores! And we take a drive to Clutch City as they take the lead. Well, the lead is in their hands, and now it's about building off of that. Good shift management, dictating pace, controlling the offensive zone. Everything now is on the line. one here in the second period and I like that jump in their step we're starting to see here now. We've really seen an uptick in their momentum in the last few shifts and they're rewarded with that goal James. They've got to continue to attack the net, ski downhill and not be afraid to get to the paint. Sends it in deep. Scooped up along the wall by Snively. Quick pass to Ness. Oh, great puff save by Erson. Brody's been feeling James. You know who else is feeling it? His teammates. They have been the beneficiaries of a great leader on the ice who's just been distributing the puck and generating a ton of offense. The Phantoms win the defensive zone faceoff. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. Takes the puck. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Oh, tremendous save on the one timer. The Bears carry the one-timer, but what I like about it is that he's already said he knows exactly where that puck is coming and he just wires it home.
Hershey's now gone up by two here in the second, and what a performance so far. They have been absolutely dominant, Cheryl. They've been dominant. I think their coaching staff will like the performance that they put in so far. It'll be about capitalizing and finishing the rest of the way, but their possession, the majority of shots, everything's in their favor right now. Yeah, that's a bad pass, and they'll be forced to do this over again. The Bears move the puck in the defensive zone. Pushes it across to Vecchione. Moves it up. Fast and quick lead pass. Slides it back to the blue line. Lays out to get in front of that one. Lehigh Valley's gained possession along the boards. Through center. The Bears gain possession. In all alone! He scores! Oh, wow, what a play! Well, he uses his speed to break away from his opponent and reads exactly what the goaltender is giving him to be able to convert. What a beautiful play. The Bears are firing on all cylinders tonight. Look at the scoreboard now, and there's no end in sight. We're only here late in the second. Well, I mean, it's been a wave of energy, just shift after shift, and no matter who goes out there, they find a way to cash in, get it done, maintain possession. This is a team that, you said it, they're firing on all cylinders, James. This is going to be an absolute blowout. Picked up along the boards by Corker. The Bears gain control of the puck. It into the offensive zone. The Phantoms get a hold of the puck in their own end. Still has possession. The Bears have it behind the net. And they'll be forced to tag up after that missed pass. Sent into the offensive zone. Puck said down the ice. We'll get an icing. Hershey's looking to carry this sizable lead here into the second intermission. They have been the dominant club tonight. And they win the draw in the offensive zone, and they go to work. Center wins that one clean. Everyone's ready for the puck. They know they're attacking now with the tired group that they're playing against. Here's a short pass to Rowe. And the middle frame almost done. Grabbed along the board by Huntington. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Stopped by the goaltender getting a piece of that one. Shepard's done a good job making that save, especially because it's been a quiet night for him. It's been an offensive explosion in the other end, but when you're faced with a save, you have to make it. You don't want to open. Opening face-off for period number three is ready to go. It's been a total mismatch here as we get underway for the third of the season. Smart decisions. And, and here we go. And there's the winning blow. Did he ever connect on that one, James? And now look at him on the ice. He's laboring to get up. Sometimes you hate to be on the other side of this. You know that your opponent, when they're getting blowed out late in the game, they're going to be physical. They're going to get the fists up. A lot of myths going at it. And this is a product of frustration. You're getting blown out in the game. You're just trying to send a message. The Bears take possession off the faceoff. And that doesn't reach the net. Ahead of steam now towards the front. That eyes him on the play. The Bears have it against the wall. Hershey's sliding the puck behind the net. Tees him up. Taken along the wall by Snively. Slides the puck down low. There he is from the slot. The Phantoms have it now. 
From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Shot, and he gets down to block it. Picked up along the wall by Heinen. Mete's got it against the boards. Here he is in front. Poked away. The Bears have it now. From the right side, he goes to the middle of the neutral zone. Ness has been terrific tonight in showing his high hockey IQ. I mean, to find open players like that, you've got to manipulate your opponent, open the lane. And when he sees it, he does it. The Bears continue to lead big here in this third period. The Phantoms win the draw on their own end. Feeds it to Gardner. Picking up momentum across the zone here on the right side. Scores! Jumps all over his rebound and puts it in. This is what you call having a nose for the net. You take the initial shot and you get back to the front of the net for your own rebound. That's a great tenacious goal. Lehigh Valley's got to dig down and see if they've got a couple more of those on their sticks tonight. If only they could start that way, hey, James? No but they kidding. need to look to finish with desperation and urgency if they want to give themselves an opportunity to even get their tender out. Takes the pass from the left wing. Cuts to the front. That goes off the blocker. What a save by Shepard. The Bears take it across the blue line. What a blocker save by Ayrson. Great positioning by the goaltender to redirect it to the corner, getting it out of danger. The Phantoms take it along the wall. Oh, what a slick stop by Shepard. There's a firm collision. Lehigh Valley's got the puck along the wall. Quick pass to Willman. Gains the zone along the right wall. Sends a pass over. The Phantom slide the puck behind the net. Grabs it in his own end. Lehigh Valley's got it along the wall. Takes the knot, but he's still got the puck. They go on the attack from the left side. Puck picked up by Becciardi. And he was locked in on that save as play continues. Cuts into the paint. And just got a piece of it to keep it out. Brody's back on the ice after serving a five-minute major for fighting. And he had an opportunity to rest and relax in the box. As sometimes fighting can take a lot out of you. He steps on the ice and gets a great scoring chance. His time is better served on the ice. Slides the puck to Samula. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. And the game on a breakaway with the empty net. Scores into the empty net. Now I feel like you must have had a few empty netters in your day. Oh, yeah. Listen, I was on the back end. I didn't have hands. So when I scored one, listen, I celebrated. I was down and <laughs> out, fist pumping everywhere, even when it was the empty net. Hershey's all but got this thing wrapped up here late in the third. They have capitalized on many scoring chances tonight. Brooks wins the draw. Hershey stopped the puck. Looks like there's a delayed penalty being called here by the officials. That's all she wrote from this one. The Bears just had one of those nights where I'm sure everybody in the organization is going home smiling. Well, they should be. They had the puck on their stick, and they retrieved it. And once they retrieved it, their opponent was chasing the game. And that is a wonderful place to be, James, playing for Canada all those years. I certainly know what that felt like. Well, that brings the night to an end, and we will say goodbye here from Rookside from all of us here at EA Sports. My name is James Samoski. 